The 2018 Kia Stinger is a provocatively named, turbocharged fastback sedan that arrives in America in a few months, and we've just been given a great snapshot of what to expect at Germany's notorious Nürburgring circuit while the very final tuning is underway. The late-stage prototypes we drove are 99% there, says Albert Biermann, former BMW M chief engineer, now head of engineering for the Hyundai Group despite our first experience with the Stinger being at a famously technical track. Biermann and others stress that the Stinger is very much a grand tourer. To be clear, just about no one will track the Stinger so why then do we find ourselves in the Eiffel region of Western Germany? Because Korea's new sports sedan signals a dramatic brand shift for Kia, and the Stinger GT is the first to reflect a new, more performance-oriented direction Kia at the Nürburgring? If you want to make a point, this is one way to do it arriving this fall, the Stinger will have three powertrain options on offer globally, but only two gas-fueled turbocharged engines for North America. The entry-level Stinger 2.0T is rated at 255 horsepower and 260 pounds FT, but our impressions are based on the GT, motivated by Kia's brawnier 3.3-liter twin-turbo, good for 365 horsepower and 376 pounds FT peak power arrives at 6,000 RPMs, and peak torque between 1,300 and 4,500 RPM all engines, including the Not For America 2.2-liter diesel are mated to an 8-speed automatic transmission with shift paddles both rear-wheel drive and odd configurations will be available. While the automaker has made some sporty-looking, attractive sedans such as the Optima Turbo and Cadenza, it wants to make them drive like they look says Biermann throw the ring 73 corners, 17% incline, and 11% decline, all at speed, and you'll learn quite a bit about Kia's newest, very quickly. <laughs>